Today I'm going to talk to you about brush cleaning. It's something I get asked about a lot and it is really important to keep your brushes nice and clean and sanitised but also helps with your makeup application. Um, with powder brushes, so this is um, an eyeshadow brush, then it's very important to keep that clean because the build up of powder can sometimes mean that when you're using lighter shadows or darker shadows, it all becomes a bit bit muddy and not very easy to um, apply. So, um, and with foundation brushes or concealer brushes where you're using cream products, then they can make the bristles start to stick together after a while. And that will end up meaning that your makeup application again won't be as smooth because they will clump together and you won't be able to buff the makeup into the skin. So it's very simple, um, the way that I would clean my personal brushes, which is different to how I would clean my professional brushes, um, which need to be completely sanitised. But if it's for your own use, um, using the foundation brush to begin with, I use um, washing up liquid. Um, this does have slight antibacterial properties to it anyway, but it really helps to break down the, the cream products. Um, in a way that something like baby shampoo won't. So I just put a tiny bit in my palm, add a little bit of water, and then I will swirl the brush around in my palm and really gently try to remove the cream products. So it might look like I'm doing this quite vigorously, but I am being very gentle so that I don't ruin the brush. Then what you do, I get a little bit of running water, not too, too much, but just start to really rinse out that lava, pulling out the cream product at the same time, making sure that the, the brush is always facing downwards, never upwards, otherwise the water is going to go down into the brush handle and it will get ruined. But if you follow these techniques, then your brushes should last for a long time. So that has removed quite a lot of the cream product that was there. What I would normally do would be to go in there and do that again and repeat, make sure all the lather has been removed. And as you can see, I'm trying to reshape the brush. I get a towel, a clean towel, and I squeeze the bristles together, reshaping the brush, and then lay, lay them over the side of the worktop or um, a table, dressing table, Never leave them to dry like that because again, any moisture will go down in, into the, the brush. So that is how you would clean a brush that's had a cream product on it. You can use the same technique for a powder brush as well, but you wouldn't need fairy, you could just use normal shampoo or baby shampoo, which is gentler, or you can buy brush cleaners. This is from Superdrug, I think it costs less than five pound. These are fine if you just want a quick and easy clean, but I don't think they do as good a job as proper washing with soap. So I would spray some onto a tissue or kitchen roll and then swirl the brush around again gently. You can see that the product's coming out and I would just continue to do that until all of the, the brush is clean. You may need to give it another spray. And then using these brush cleaners, they should dry quite quickly. I would lay it over the side again. It doesn't look as clean as it would do with shampoo, but it's gonna be perfectly fine um, if you want to start using different colors. So any questions or anything, please um, just pop in the comments below um, and I'll be happy to answer them. Thank you.